Oh, that's a good one, guys. That's a good one. Oh, there's one. Oh, that's a good one. Ooh, ooh, stay down, Bubba. Oh, that was a good eat. Good eat. Looks like a decent fish. Oh, it is. Hey gang, it's me, Ola, coming at you from somewhere deep, deep in the mountains. Yes, I am way east and way south. I'm down east, and I'm in the rolling hills and beautiful surrounding mountains in this majestic little lake. It's called a pond, but at a thousand acres, I'd call it a lake. I pretty much covered the whole lake, too. Went all the way around it. We're at 7.2 miles and 6 hours, 30 minutes. So, good day of fishing. Landed 19 bass. I got at least one upgrade, decent one. Had a giant break me off. And this is a lake known for smallmouth. I got approximately zero smallmouths. I'm just flabbergasted. I do fine in the river. Small, small mouth in the river, no problem. Get me in a lake and I get one or two, if that. But this, this is famous for small mouth. Good ones, too. But I'll be darned, I couldn't get on one. And I fished what I thought would be small mouth little holes, and, but not one complaint because the large mouth were feisty and fierce. And I think I got around five pickerel, too. They're all so fierce, no matter where you catch them. So I'm probably going to stay in the current position I was at, but I'll put the leaderboards for WFF and KBF over here. But anyways, how about if I roll you today's gorgeous mountain pond fishing footage? Good morning, folks. 6.07 on Monday. Take it in. Dead silent in the mountains down east. Guys, it doesn't get much better than this. I keep saying that, but shoot, every time I fish, I find something more beautiful. Look at the crystal clear water. Lord have mercy, this is beautiful. And it's silent. I met two, two of the residents that are near the launch, and uh, they were very nice. They welcomed me and told me good luck. Told me what a beautiful gem they have here. Told me that they don't get many visitors. So. Let's see if this visitor can get on a small mouth or two. This lake is primarily a small mouth fishery. I bet you there's large in here too though. So anyway, let's get my cameras aimed properly. SPF 50 and my buff that I must cover my lips. I have my little spots on my lips that I can't clear up. Wow. I'm just blown away at the silence. Oh. Let's see if we can get on some fish here. Stick around, folks. We're in for a treat. Just giant boulders. Not much wind up here. A little ripple on the water. Super crystal clear water. Might be actually hard to fish. Yeah, a lot of these are, the cabins are empty. They must just come up here on the weekend. It's all just sitting here quietly. So I timed this so that it would coincide with the major feed, which begins in about 15 minutes. So for the next couple of hours, oh, we're gonna bash into some rocks. Wow. I mean, right under the surface. 
Jeez Louise. Plan anyway to do the entire lake and go clockwise. It's about eight and a half miles around. So we'll see how that goes. Okay, where you at, fish? Got a little island out there. More pads over here. Got a lot of this pencil grass over here. Buggy whip, whatever you want to call it. I'm going to throw the Nico in this exposed grass here. There's a few pads over there. Oh. It's got to be a small mouth, guys. This has to be a small mouth. Oh, it is. Not. <laughs> It's a daggum largemouth. Guys, this fishery isn't even listed as a largemouth fishery. Look at that dude. That is beautiful. First fish of the day. Let's get a measurement right in the corner. He was in those little pads. It's not even a largemouth fishery. I find them. I find the largemouth. They like are attracted to me. I'm a largemouth magnet. Oh, fish. Fish. He's not happy, of course. Can't blame him. Let's just take a photo and let you go. What the heck? I did not even see that fish get out. No big loss. He was just a catch-22, but I did not even see him get out. Wow, I'm going to have to look at the replay on this when I get home. That's a sneaky fish. Sneaky fish. Wow. Well, that's one. Let's see what else we can do here. It's another daggum largemouth. Camera's malfunctioned. Nutter largey. Up in the boulders there. Look at that. Look at that healthy hombre. <laughs> there he goes. There he goes, people. That's beauty. Hey, fish. My goodness. Another one. What is it? A pick or a largemouth pick? It's a pick roll. There he goes. First pick of the day. They love these flukes. There's one. Let's see if we can keep him on. Oh, it's a large mouth. Oh, actually, it is pretty big. Come here, Bubba. Actually, that's decent. Nice, he's heavy. There's my hole in my net from the other day. Okay, guys, I swapped over to a craw because they're just not hitting much else. That's a Decent fish. Wow. That's a beauty. All right. It's the third large mouth, and this is a small, small mouth lake. Go figure. Let's put him on the board. Let's see if I can keep this one in the net, huh? He's not going to help anything except for catch 22. But uh, I need big fish for my monthly challenges. Man, I do not want to blow into that because I'm going to fish that. Probably a fish under that tree. Quick photo fish. Come here. Dang, that's a good fish. That is such a healthy fish. That's an update. Oh, yeah, that's an upgrade. I think I got him. I think I got him. Let me check. I only got one. Okay, everything's good. Everything's good. All right, fish. Let's let him go. That's a beautiful fish. Let's let him go. Check that out. Beauty. That's a beauty. Thank you, fish.
That's a good one. That's a good one. Always in the grass. Let's get him out. That's another large male. Looks like another large you get out of. Oh, yeah. He's decent. We're in the second part of the major. Oh, gosh, look. Boink. No penetration. Oh, fish. That's That guy's going to be hard to measure if you watch. He's going to make me fight him. He's just for the catch-22. Come here, you little ornery turd, you. Ah, he's fighting tooth and nail. Finally, the bites kind of turned on, or they just wanted this craw over anything else. Come here, you little pit bull. It's time to go. Fifteen five, folks. Thank you, fish. Okay, my thoughts are that the smallmouth are going to be in the deeper water. So I'm going to be looking for some offshore structure here. My Navionics doesn't really show me any details like that, but I have a little pinch point area with some huge boulders that I bet you go way out. So on that point, I'm going to see if there's some deep submerged boulders. I got him on the third try. That's a bass. It's a large mouth. That smaller one. He hit it like four times before I got him. He's a little turkey, but he's he's a keeper. He's legit. Fourteen on the nose. Thank you, fish. Oh, this breeze feels real good, folks. Needed it gonna pick up a little bit more than I'd like but we're gonna roll with it oh pickerel maybe oh it's bigger I can't see it yet maybe it's a bass yep it's a large mouth that's a good eat Decent fish. Oh, we came off in the net. Oh gosh, look. Look at the hole in my net. Get in there. That's where I had to cut it the other day. I guess I'm getting a new net. I'm getting a new net. Yep. I'll order that as soon as I get home. That's the one I had to cut because the dead um oh you know what? I bet that's how the fish just got out. That one fish, the first one, that's how it got out. It was small enough. Oh, yeah, that's a decent fish. It's not an upgrade. Second biggest of the day, 1650. Oh, that was a good eat. Good eat. Looks like a decent fish. Oh, it is. It's decent. Come here, Bubba. 
he's digging. Ah, they're going through the hole in my net. The net got bigger hole. Another beauty. Wonder if I have something I can put across that hole. He's going to get out. He's going to get out. Just remember if I get a giant, I can't net him. I can't keep him in the net. Oh, see? He just got out. Well, folks, that's a drag. What do I have that I can put across that hole? They're just making it bigger and bigger. Okay, I'm doing a, a homemade stitch job. I don't know if it's going to hold or not, but it's got to help me for today. My home ec class flashbacks are coming back. Not really. Okay, it's ugly, but we'll see if it holds out. Just has to hold them in the basket. In case I get a big one. So these deeper boulders here look like small mouth territory. Let's see if we got anything in there. Throw in a Nico because it'll sink straight to the bottom. Might put a tiny child on because it'll get in between these cracks here. Yeah, this is six feet right where I'm at. Boy, I need some wind. Look at all these boulders. I love fishing around boulders. Oh man, oh man, stay down. That's just a largey, but man. Oh, he just came off. Mm -mm, stay down, Bubba. I remedied my net problem. Nothing big. We'll, we'll see if he gets out the hole. See if he tears it a new, bigger hole. Nothing giant yet, but man, these are strong fish. Super strong fish. Fourteen five. Thank you, fish. That's the smallest of the day. Portly belly, though. Wow. Thanks, fish. I think I'm going to make my way across right here. I am on the very end of the lake. I think it's a, a northwest end. I am going to make my way across. We have some submerged boulders, it looks like, in the middle of the lake. So maybe that'll be holding some fish. And I'll hit the other bank. There are a couple of creek entrances over there. See what we can get on. Got this little peninsula here. I wonder if that's worth hitting. Oh, I'm, I'm going against the breeze now. I get to feel it. Time to cover my lip up, too. SPF 50 plus buff. It's probably still not enough. Oh, there's something big. <laughs> 
That was a good jump. He's swimming right at me. He's swimming right at me. It's a large mouth, I'm pretty sure. Come here, Bubba. Large mouth city. I'm on top of a rocky outcropping. I'm not going to measure him. Thank you, fish. Rocky outcropping. He got my weight. Whoa. <laughs> Let's keep him out of the grass, whatever it is. Oh, it's a huge bass. Huge bass. Big old bass. Stay down, mister. No, it's not big. Good lord. He's just rowdy. That is one rowdy bass. Look at that. Gosh, the way he bit that. Thank you, fish. My net job is holding up with my sewing stitches. There's an opening in the middle. Let's throw it in there. Although if I get something, it's gonna be harder than I'll get out. Oh, there's a fish on it already. That must just be loaded in there. I'm not sure I can get him out. Yeah, he just threw it. I'm going to pull up my drive and stand right here and cast from here. Let's see if we can get on a big one in this grass. They're in here feeding. This way, if I do hook into one, I can pull myself through the grass at least. It is a foot deep. Now I won't get a bite. Oh, that guy just jumped. Oh, he's chasing it. Guys, this is a blast. I think it's a little bass. Wow, oh, that's decent. It's decent bass. Gosh. Wow. Unbelievable. Wow, what a thick mouth this one has. Thick lip. Oh, that's a mean, mean, mean old fish. Dang. He gave himself away. He came out of the water chasing something. And I threw at him and he was so fired up he couldn't stop. He ate it and ate it and ate it. Some good quality today, folks. let them go 16 and a quarter thank you fish coming up on some prime area Let's see if anybody's up there feeding someone's on it oh Oh my gosh. Get out of that grass. Maybe that's my small... Oh, he just went deep in the grass. Come here. Get out of there. There he goes. Wow, what a fight. What a heavy fish. Uh-oh. Got more nicks in my line. Wow. What a chunk. Whew. Up there right where he should have been. Come here, you big brute. What a fight. What a fight. That's some quality fish, guys. Big old 16er. Thank you, fish. Go deep in there. Come on, come get it. 
Oh, he's on it. Mm, he's on it. These fish are so strong. It's a large mouth. Another large mouth. Gosh, he is just plump. Plump and robust. Boy, if the slot was 16, I'd be in business. Lots of healthy, healthy fish. 1575. Thank you, fish. The tiniest largemouth of the day. What a cutie, though. 15.5 and so skinny. Thank you, fish. 15.5. Thank you, fish. He is super slimy. Thank you, fish. Mm -hmm.